In the experimental verification of the resonance, we use a capacitor. Its capacitance was measured with the LC meter, 0.49 microfarads. The ballast from a fluorescent lamp, with an inductance of 0.862 Henry, is used as a coil. The DC resistance of the coil was measured with the multimeter at 46.5 ohm. We connect the coil and the capacitor in series. We supply the circuit from the function generator with a sinusoidal voltage of 200 millivolts peak to peak. We measure with a multimeter the RMS current value and with an oscilloscope the supply voltage and the capacitor voltage. The instrument calculates the RMS value of the two voltages and the phase difference between them. We vary the frequency around the theoretical resonance value. We observe that at 246 Hz, the current and the capacitor voltage take the maximum value while the phase difference is about 90 degrees. The overvoltage at the resonant frequency is defined by the quality factor. The effective resistance of the coil is much higher than the DC value due to the skin effect and the proximity effect. By increasing the voltage from the function generator to 2 volts peak to peak, we notice that the circuit no longer works in resonance, which was not expected. The resonant frequency is 230 Hz because the resistance and inductance of the coil have changed. Resonance is essential at the telecommunication receivers, but is undesirable on the grid. In particular, the distortion of the 50 Hz sinusoidal voltage, manifested by the small fifth harmonic, at 250 Hz, causes, due to the resonance, in it, the shown capacitor voltage. Thank <music> you.